Good evening. Uh, let's whack the lights on. There we go. Um, I said good evening because I'm so used to streaming in the evening, but here we are in the afternoon. Um, so good afternoon. Um, just throwing out some DVD action. I figured I'd sort of sat down for a session and why not put it out there. Um, so new patch, new ruin, and um, yep. Here we go. Uh, so playing a bit of Nurse to begin with. We'll then see if we want to jump in on Survivor after that. But for now, Nurse Action. Just popping the chat up there. We'll wait for Discordance to tell us where they all are, but in the meantime... No doubles. No doubles. Alright. So let's go... Straight to our ruin. So, Nia knows where it is. She needs to die. And thus, she dies. For this game, I have replaced Pop Goes the Weasel as my endgame piece to Noed as my endgame piece, since Noed is uh, stronger, but only applies in the endgame. Normally, Pop applies for the whole game, but since uh, Ruin now sort of hard counters my own Pop, um... Oh, beautiful. So we get the hit. She then tries to circle short. Yeah, she does. Doesn't go for the turnaround, though. Smart, smart. Someone should now go for the save because they've heard me blink. But they didn't, so they were obviously all hard-focusing gens. I'm a little bit more protective of this hook than usual. Because of um, Ruin being there. Now, Ruin is going to regress that gen nicely for me. We need to get this girl hooked immediately and get back over there. So, I need to basically do this and then blink straight to Ruin. She's going to try and, uh, and get Ruin. She didn't. That's great for us. Well, actually, it's not because we would have stopped it. So, fair enough. Uh, we're going to go make sure that that gen continues to regress. It does, so Ruin's doing its thing. That's great. She's marking that I'm close, which suggests that someone else is close. Nia should go back for that Ruin. And indeed she does. actually Claudette. Fine, doesn't matter. She should suck down this corner. Oh, I didn't quite re react fast enough. I got the right read, but not the right play. I'm all ears gives me the Claudette. She played that well. Especially considering she didn't know we had the aura on her. I'm going to check Ruin good. We've seen her. We know she's gone this way. There she is. And we nail it. That's good news. Now, she should go immediately for Ruin. We're going to try and get the pick up and run to Ruin. We want to keep this hook pressure because it keeps the other guys busy so they're not all doing gens. And they get the Ruin. That's sad news. Alright. So... Oh 
normal game resumes now. Sans Ruin. That I just really didn't expect as a run around the corner into me, so that's hilarious. I'm all ears. The blink was too short. That is bad play. That was pretty good play there. So let's see if we can capitalize. Okay, she's here. Going this way. And now we need to cut her off as she tries to run around. Yes, there we go. Yeah, you could tell she was looking behind her. She was waiting for the blink so she could turn around, so we had no problem. What the hell are they doing? Right, they're doubling up on a gen. We're going to run towards it to put pressure on them, see if we can get either one of them to run off. Looks like we've succeeded, so that's great. We don't have Pop the Weasel, but since we're going to be in this vicinity anyway, we'll set the regression going. Now then. There we go. Stumbled across one. So... Where's she running? There. They get a gen, but they haven't got the unhook yet, and I've already got my next hook, so we're keeping the hook pressure up. We're going to move her over here because there's no gen over here, so it means that if they're coming to save her, they are wasting plenty of time. We'll then nip straight back to the gen, obviously. wasn't willing to pull the trigger because I didn't see a survivor fast enough. So we've now got the two blinks recharged. No one's gone inside the house, almost certainly to go through the house for the save. Yes indeed. So we've now got two of them cornered. Good. The other one might have decisive, so perfectly happy to get the hit on the saver. Are you crawling off to, lady? Right, whack her behind the house. It's not actually a very good spot, but it was close to where I was. We'll get back to the gen. This gen, I think. Yep. So we're on the claw deck. I think that is so close that this regression is a waste of time, but if it's only claw deck that was on it, we can chase her off. Yeah, it wasn't. Alright, they should be going for the save now. Beautiful. Oh, they can have that unhook, I'm not that bothered. They're all here, so we've got all four of them. If we don't get this hook, it'll be very sad news. We get it. Woo! Just checking to see if one of them managed to sneak past me.
Gonna have to just hope she doesn't have it. I've downed her, so let's hope. She doesn't. Great. A lot of people are getting greedy with decisives, so... They're doubling up on that top gen, so we get the kill. Now we need to be fast up here. We get the no head. She wasn't expecting that. She's just killed herself, right, okay. Nobody on that one, they should be on this one. Two of them left. One blink, two blinks. Not on it, Jesus! Forgot that wall was unblinkable. Nobody there either. They've gone for this one. I saw track marks, I know they're around here. So I'm going to let them go for it. And immediately track back the line of sight. Now this situation blows a little bit because because they've used a kick. We found it. And she's found the hatch with a key. Oh. Nerf ruin, don't nerf keys. A chest key, a chest key, great. Yeah, that was a bitch. So, a camping style or a defensive style, um, depending on whether you're a killer or a survivor, um, will be effective, I think, in this meta because people are skimping on decisive strike. Uh, including myself, I keep finding myself not taking it and being greedy. It is greedy not to take decisive strike. If you don't take it, you're opening yourself up to being... Uh, tunneled to hell and um and thus camping works very well because you stay near a hook now with nurse you can stay quite far from a hook and still be considered camping because you can blink to it in one go and sort of reenact a chase uh, or re-engage a chase sorry um so 
being able to uh, being able to tunnel people means you get a survivor out the game earlier on, and that is very important for then being able to flick them around off uh, off gens. Now, our ruin being found immediately, like it was the first blink we made, was to head to our ruin. The second blink we made was to hit the survivor off ruin that was already cleansing it. So, about as early a ruin find as there is, short of it just going down without you actually having any say. Um, so we managed to chase them off it for a little bit, but then they found it and got it. And so we didn't get to play with Ruin. We didn't have Pop as a backup, so we had no Ed for that late game backup. And it kind of worked. It worked in the sense that um, we got that insta down on the girl on the gen. She thought she was going to get a hit and get away. Didn't. Bang. Hooked. Um, and then... Um, I think this... I think those... Were they the same names as in the previous game? Don't know. Um... Maybe not. So, uh, Noed gave us the, the movement speed and the confidence to be able to patrol endgame really pretty well. And gave us that insta down, which was pretty nice. So, uh, this combination of ruin early, Noed late, I'm all ears in the middle and discordance to try and slow them down a bit. Um, especially in combination with ruin if I can push them off. By finding them with Discordance, then Ruin will regress automatically, uh, as long as it's up. So we're relying on Totems a bit more than I'd like, but... Um, yeah, uh, we, we're trying Noed, we'll see how it goes. Instead of Pop, I think it's a stronger late game, and depending on how long Ruin lasts, that's more time that Pop is not available, and Noed is simply a much stronger late game piece than Pop is. So... Um, I mean, I love Pop. Pop's one of my favourite perks, and it's such a great slowdown piece, but the fact that it has specific, very hard anti-synergy with, um, with the new Ruin um, means that we're going to have to try without it for a bit. Obviously, I can try both. I can try dropping Ruin. I, I think Ruin is still strong enough where you want to keep it, but again, we're playing lots of games with Ruin to get proper data. You need lots of different maps, because, for example, Ruin is much uh, stronger on smaller maps, especially multi-layered ones, especially with the Nurse, so Gideon Meat Plant is even better for us, because I can push people off all the time, and it will just constantly regress massively, uh, and it will force them to get very brave and come back to hooks, and then I can swoop in and take advantage. Cold Wind is the opposite. It's the map we just played, not specifically, because it wasn't Rancid Abattoir, but so uh, you get the point. It is massive, uh, so we're going to have to hope for Discordance. Three, two, one, here we go. Right, we have to warm up the blinks a smidge. Warm up the blinks. So this Meg is happy to take us for a run around. And I'm happy to cock up my blinks and let her do it, apparently. Alright, there we go. I'm all ears. She's not trying to do anything sneaky. She's just... Oh, there goes her dead hard. That's great. Great, but it does at least get ruined doing its thing. That one is off. Beautiful. Let's go. And we go. Nice. They get ruined. So that's very bad.
I'm all ears. Gives us that for free. Nobody seems to be going for the unhook yet, so let's. Could have, I could have maybe, could have, would have, should have slugged her. Let's check. Nope, didn't go that way, so I'm going to assume it's this way. Yes. We get hit on the David. Is he going to go straight for the dash unhook? Yep, so we'll take the hook swap. We know that one is injured. And that she's just here. She didn't go for the save, so she's being sneaky. She'll come back to this corner. No, she won't. We're cutting her off from the rescue. It's wasting a lot of their time, but it's wasting a lot of my time. Dead hard, we got the dead hard out of him, good stuff. He has just gone for being quiet over there, but he's not on a gen, and this lady is, so let's. They're using these cornfields well. Line of sight is a big thing for the nurse. And I'm currently struggling from a lack of it. Nobody on that one from the sounds of it. friendly blink bug. Yeah, so we're not going to be able to blink properly for a good long while now. And even if we do correctly... Oh, nice. I do love I'm all ears. Oh, but I can't blink twice because of the bug, so I'm just completely screwed here. Can't blink twice, just can't do it. I have one blink and then I get... <laughs> I presume that you guys are seeing what I'm seeing. So at least you know that I'm not making it up. No, that is not the correct angle. No, she's dead. I'll take a free hit, thank you. I'll take another one, thank you. And another. Thank you very much. Too slow. Dead hard. Wait for the double blink. Got it. Nailed it. 
no borrowed. Wow, they're greedy. Check for Dad Hard. He's probably got a uh, decisive. He's David, so he should have it. He doesn't. He's so greedy. So greedy. Dead hard from her. Oh, perfect. She wasted that before I was even blinded. She didn't make that jump? I am actually really surprised. No one on that gem. We're now into a three gen spot, so we need to be focused on gens. Blood here. We've got her. Accounted for the sprint burst. Walk past this. We can knock anyone off who's on it. Oh dear god, we fucked it. I forgot that I used this hook to kill someone, so we're going to have to try and make it to this hook, and we may well not make it. This could be really, really bad. Oh, that was close. Jesus. Right. She's dead. Where's the third gen? Over here, and they are on it. They probably think I've got barbecue and chill, because they legged it immediately. That's interesting. Check. Discordance isn't warning us of any 44ing going on. Behind this rock. No. Not it. Where the hell is she gone now? Yeah, spotted it again. Good little sneak about, aren't they? We know the other ones over there. We've seen the scratch marks. First hook on sneaky girl. Here they go. she goes. Right, we'll slug her. Oh, that's it. It's just these two. Right, we'll just slug her for a bit. I can't remember when we last down this girl and she might be within decisive strike uh, range and I'm just not taking that risk. She might have unbreakable. So I'll just be ready to mouse her immediately if she stands up. Also, I mean, it's theoretically possible that this girl has deliverance, so we don't want to pick this one up and then let her unhook herself, so. 
We are costing ourselves points with uh, proximity to hook here, but I'll live. Also save some time because she just gets immediately hooked down to zero. So, um, no Ed didn't come in that game, but it almost did. They were down to the last gen. Um, Pop would have come in a reasonable amount. I'm going to do try and do that comparison for each game and have a little think about it. Uh, Ruin did a lot of work early on. Uh, Pop would have helped quite a bit in the later game situation. That's a rank up. Almost a double. So, yep. One had a decisive, but it was actually the um, it was actually the near. This was the near with the iron will, and this was the meg with the iron will. In fact, the three of them had iron will. You could see why I was having issues with it. Sneaky bastards! There was just this guy that was doing a obviously a fresh uh, a fresh David, I think. Any we do not have any blink distance uh, add ons. So, when playing nurse, use blink distance add ons. Uh, let's have a look at so that one and that one. So there, and we also need that one. So, Kavanaugh's, I don't care about discordance. Blink speed, blink speed, blink speed, blink speed, blink speed, blink speed. Uh, I'm okay, yeah, no. Um, so we want now the blink fatigue, and then. Ah, we didn't get it, so we'll go for the Don't recharge. We'll just load a couple of these. Teeth, very, very good. Gideon, very, very, very good. Blink distance, probably the best thing we can find. Blink distance, matchbox is pretty good, let's not lie. McMillan is not great, honestly. Larry's. I mean, I'll take some map ones just so that whenever I want to, I can pick a particular map. I mean, the new Larry's is really, really beautifully made. So, you know, why not? Jigsaw piece, very important. Undetectable is very good. Match tooth. Mm. So that one's very good as well. So let's go this way and here, ready to get the range and the tooth. Then this way for the undetectable. And then we'd like to get into there, I think, and then up to there. So we'll take here. I'll take that one, see where it goes. It goes that way. Matchbox is really pretty good. We'll take the blink distance because the most important tooth next. He's going to go there. I'll go here. I'll take the Gideon. And then I go for the, that. And then the rest of it doesn't matter. Right, and now we can put on some decent add-ons. Just check there's nothing specific. Oh my god, three teeth. Beautiful. And a Mori. Not bad. Right, anyway, let's pop on the... Tremendous blink range because it's very very strong And um, we'll go for um, Blood points at the moment because we are actually spending and we don't have uh, a million so why not? Get more So yeah add-ons for nurse uh, the tooth is a basically like a mini nurse's calling so basic like the thing is that with the combination of the fact that you're playing nurse means that people think oh nurse is calling probably 
better not heal while I'm in a terror radius. And then there is the fact that if they aren't sort of smart about it and they don't do that, then you actually have a mini nurse's calling even though you don't use a perk slot for it. So, um... Using nurses is pretty good. Let's see what might we get. Come on, meat plant. With new ruin, it should be really, really strong as well. But with old ruin, it was uh, an insane map for Nurse in general. Just her ability to move up and down. Although Pop Goes the Weasel was a big part of that. And I have dropped that now. Um, we'll see. We'll see. In this particular stream, one of the main things I'm analysing is NOED and seeing whether I think it is useful enough, often enough, to warrant its place versus Pop the Weasel as one option, Sloppy Butcher as another. Um, oh god, the only map we absolutely didn't want. So... The nurse cannot blink through a bat. Yay! Never been so happy about a disconnect. Nurse just can't blink through most of that map. It is disgusting. That was superb news. Let's do another blood web while we wait. So we do want that... We do want that very much. Springwood's good, but not, you know, super good or anything. It's pretty good for Nurse, honestly. Uh, blood Pudding's great, obviously. Maury's good. Triple Teeth is amazing. Matchbox is good. Right, let's go. Tooth, Tooth, Tooth. We know it's going to Discordance, we know it's going there, so we can take range. Get the Pied Piper, get the Blink Range, get the uh, get the Blood Pudding, get the Mori, and that is a basically perfect uh, Blood Web. That was superb. That'll do me for a little while, don't need to do anything uh, anything silly after that. So let's see what items we're up against. Two med kits, four megs. Alrighty. Oh, and a toolkit thrown in at the end there. Little toolbox, a little, little cheeky extra. So what we're going to hope is, if we get lucky, that toolbox girl. 44s with one of the other survivors. Discordance pops. I pop them off and we get maximum ruin value early on. I'll try and chase the one with the toolbox, but at the moment when you're getting in there after a blink, you don't have time to sort of have a look at their items. Like, oh, what do you have? No, you'd have to chase somebody, so... We'll see how it goes. Right, my ruin is far side. Discordance crops immediately on the first away gen, and we see another girl here. So, push her off. Look like we're blinking towards her, so she has to move and then bang. They jump off, predictably. And we get the toolbox going. Well, 
don't think I could have called that much better if I tried. Ooh, could have blinked, uh, could have lunged slightly better though. There she goes. Oh, she didn't turn around there for the second one. That is. Oh, ruins down as well. Anyway, we get the tool. Let's go. That is going to be done. There's nothing we can do. Ruins already down. So now pop would be amazing, but sadly we are testing out without it. So, one gen here, one gen there. I'm going to presume that they're on... Oh wait, no, they're going to come back round this way, right? For the save. Three, two, one, save. No, two on this gen, discordance, and wasting blinks. How very annoying. Afternoon, Matthias. How are you doing? We're going to charge up the blink charges. Push them off this. Not that it matters because Ruin's already gone. That's upsetting. Let's turn around. We know there were two of them. And there she is. Thanks to the discordance, we can get her... Oh, that was bad news, though. Are they on another... Oh, I'm all ears. Gives us the goods. They've got the save. Deciding if I want to rage quit kill her. Yeah, I um, fully sympathise. Don't worry. I'll do my best to hurt some survivors this game for you. Just so that you can morally feel that something has gone well in the world. Oh, read that quite well, but just not quite well enough. So, we've just spotted her here a little bit. How'd you like that? How'd you like the blink cancel there, my lady? You've now got to fuck off. Someone else has to come and do the save, which wastes a lot of everybody's time. I'm, for one, I'm delighted. Hiding just around the corner is not a trick that I have not seen before. So, let's see if we can land. Oh, the old back and forth. And she's still out in the open without many pallets to get to or anything. Around she goes. Around she goes. One blink. Two blink. Oh, she actually. First of all, she played that well, and second of all, I played that horrendously. Um. Onion Huntress Miserable. Yeah, I believe you. Right, I'm going to leave her because... Stop. Stopping a 44 in gen is more important, but also happens to be impossible. So that's always nice. We let an injured survivor get away in order to chase a completed gen. We did not go through there for some fucking unknown reason. I had easily enough distance in what world was that not a grab? You even saw the grab animation start. Right. Well. We're in trouble. This is going to be a no-head game. So at least we get to... Did someone else try and jump in there? Always worth checking before you pick them up in case some fuck nugget tries to uh, dive out of a locker and stun you. Our basement is not there. We genuinely might have trouble getting her to a hook if this girl body blocks correctly. Yep, that sucks a big bag of dick. Yeah, she's taken the same route twice because she's uh, she's gone for the short back long reverse and you can't do it twice. You just can't. So, we're getting down to a lower amount of gens, which is good. 
And that's a sprint burst wasted, or used, I should say. It wasn't wasted, it did prevent her getting murdered, so. There is that. Now then, far gen is impossible for us to defend, so we're going to have to defend this side, which frankly we've done pretty well. She's kind of cut off. We're not going to blink around that corner, despite how tempting it was, because without line of sight she can play too many mind games. I read that perfectly and played it badly. That's the I'm making good reads and not capitalizing with my play, with my lunges. It is very frustrating. I'm going to see if we can land directly in this pallet. We did. But sadly, it wasn't enough to um, cancel the animation. She's gone left, I'm pretty sure. God, that was good. We get to keep the pressure up now. Pretty sure Discordance is popping off behind me. It is. And we're going to have to try and get over there. Chances are 44 seconds. It's not going to be enough. There we go. We've spotted this girl instead. So we're just going to land right on her head. Enjoy. Have a good day. Slugging that girl. We know that two of them are there. We've pushed one of them off just through the pressure. One slugged. And now we've got one slugged, one hook, and one chase. Yeah, we've played this game before, remember, lady, so let's uh, let's not fuck about, shall we? Right. Fine. Dead hard. No. I will get to the chat. This is a very intense game, so I can see that you're chatting to each other, so I don't feel like I'm leaving anybody out. I will get back to it ASAP. But this is... I'm having to work my fucking tits off here. They ran away that way last time, so I was going to expect that they're going to do it again. This girl is quite predictable. Someone might get this pallet save. No, they didn't. That's great. It means I can put pressure back on this gen. I'm going to have to get back to that garage gen because it is well on the way. This is, as I said, probably a no-ed game, but somehow we've managed to hold it away from being a no-ed game for a minute or two. Well, that was good news. For some reason, she is here. Let's see. All right. We saw that one. This girl's trying to walk it off. No, she's not. She's given up on that plan. All right, and now we've lost the pressure. So... Wait for the second blink to recharge. It takes a fucking fortnight. That was obvious, so we just blink short. We know the girl's behind this building because... Um, we prop I'm all ears. We know two of them are on that gen. And we know there's nothing we can do about it. So we're going to chase this lady. She'll have slow vaulted in here. She did indeed. Off she goes. Wait for the second blink. There it is. Nailed it. Wait for the dead hard. Oh, shit. Adrenaline. Sad times. Thing is, I've got no head, so have some of that. Alright, so they've just woken up to the bad news. Nobody there. Check for scratch marks. Reload blinks. There she is. Ah! 
Nailed it. Slug her. Don't slug her. Fuck it. Not that bothered. That guy's either got to go for door opening, unhooking, unslugging. Like he's got so many things he needs to be doing. So, is he there? No. He's gone for the unhook. Did he go for the door open first? Because if he didn't, then these two are probably fucked. Alright, she's down. Is this door open? No, not even close. Get rid of this for now. Do we see scratch marks leading to that door? I wouldn't hook them right next to my no head. That was questionable. Let's see if he's gone for a cheeky door open. Nope, so he's going for a uh, hatch escape and... Frankly, I don't blame him at this stage. So, saw him just at the last moment. Cancelled my blink bite. Oh, and of course the fucking hatch is right there. Jesus. You just have to work so fucking hard to get dicked in the ass by random chance. Fuck's sake. Oh, very glad there wasn't a reverse swear jar on there. That would have been fucking upsetting. Jesus. Right, let's catch up on some chat. Um, so, I still do well with the spirit and it's okay with the hag, but Oni Huntress games are miserable. That's what I read previously. Okay. That's a bit of a problem with killer ranks. If you get, like, rank 8 with, say, spirit and you don't have many games with Huntress or Oni, you'll get stomped by survivors. Same happened when I started playing Pig. I also don't have a decent perk load out on the Huntress or Oni yet. Yeah, that's fair. And that's the second problem I've also faced, but this one can be mitigated as you don't have to play a certain killer to level them up. True. Uh, yeah, but then it's fun to play a new killer. Yeah, uh, and maybe just play them after the rank reset. Yeah, I think that's um, all reasonable comments, reasonable uh, advice. So, rank one, two, three, one, kill uh, survivors with green, green, yellow items. And Noed was the star of that particular game. Um, Pop would have also been pretty good, because Ruin did go out rather early. But um, I think we can say with some confidence that... Um, uh, yeah... No Ed was the, the star of the show there. I mean, I'm thinking about your chat and I'm just thinking, yeah, like the idea of me playing a killer that I don't know at this rank against these level of survivors. Ugh. Uh, Discordance is very, very good. I can highly recommend this perk. I think it's, uh, I think it's superb. I'm all ears is particularly good with the nurse. I don't know if it's particularly good with many other killers. Um, I think, yeah, it, it's just so good. So, yep. Uh, gotta go visit my grandparents. I'll be back for the evening stream. All right, great. Take care, Kruka. So we got Hag, Legion, Ghostface, and just General. So we've got one flashlight, one key. So Meg needs to die. I wish I had a Mori. If I'd seen that, I'd have put a Mori on. Fuck. So we need to tunnel the bejesus out of Meg, if given the chance. I hope for her sake she's running decisive strike, because I'm coming for her. This dog is just weird. Right. My ruin is right next to a gen. A 
It's a dwarf. He's just sounding us out, and we're sounding him out. Just wanted to see what he would do. Hit, he wastes the pallet, that's good news. That's upsetting. What the fuck? That was a hit. This Meg. More importantly, me not hitting this Meg. Jesus, I've got to now wait for double blink. There it is. Black. She goes away. Black. She comes back. I'll take a free hit, but I don't really care. I'm just waiting to get my blinks back so we can get over to this Meg. Finally. Jesus. So we've lost Ruin. Janes are coming. I'm all it. What the fuck is going on? Where's the auto aim? Dwell's going for it. Does anyone want to explain what the fuck just happened? She's down. I'm not going to respect her with decisive. Yeah, I thought not. So, that pallet's already down. I mean, I'll take a free one, sure. So I am absolutely sick of losing games to keys. It is so fucking frustrating. So, he is Bill, so he's going to have borrowed time. We're just going to proc it immediately and then resume the chase. They can get the unslug, I'm not bothered. Mister, this is getting a bit annoying that my uh, blinks aren't on point today. But we do get her. She doesn't have decisive and that's her dead and key kind of gone unless somebody knows exactly where she dies and comes and picks it up, which would be irritating, but there we are. So, she's out. Don't need to worry about that anymore. We've spotted a silhouette of someone coming around this way. 
And it was Slugged Girl. Hello, Slugged Girl. How are you? Got some regression. Get the pick up. Safe against the trees, against most flashlight positions. Pop her up. Alrighty. Back to this gen. No one. This gen. No one. That gen. Someone. Injured. Get out. Alright. There goes the unhook. Straight on the gen, that is cheeky. I'm gonna bring him over. Oh, they got it as well. That is that is sad news. Really hoping one of them was gonna try and tank a hit there, because then they'd get the bad news. But I have no head, which they don't currently know. Bit annoyed about that. Now they've got the bad news. I'm slugging that one in order to try and get this one. We saw that someone was going back for us, so we're going to go straight back. We'll try and get this bill slugged. Yeah, now we go back. He went for the no-head rather than the door. Interesting call. Interesting. Whenever you found it, I suppose you'd probably do that. Is she dead? She should be, right? No. So Bill's here. He should 99 the door. He's 100 in the door. Alright, well we just push him off. Now he's dead. As long as I don't mess this up. Right. So, Noed wins another game. We just have to stand here and wait for Bill, they can't get to a hook, so as long as Bill doesn't get to walk past me, I win. Can I have a quick look for him, I suppose? Oh, here he is. Hello, Bill. Let's go and get you sorted. Welcome back. No Ed just won us another one. Oh, oh hello. Has he got decisive? Yep, he does. I shouldn't have picked him up. Why did I pick him up? Oh no, that is the most upsetting miss of the day. I was just being lazy and quick. I shouldn't have picked him up. And now we don't even rank up. We get... Oh, that was so lazy of me.
from the fact that it's in all caps, I'll presume we've got a disappointed Russian. So, what was it? Sacrifices and kills. Yeah, we, we sort of one or two hooked too many people. The gens did get done reasonably quickly because Ruin didn't do that much. We had that one guy that escaped grasp. That was a bit of a bitch. I think that should have been red. My chases were pretty... No, actually, no. I did fuck up too many chases against the... Um, against the Meg. So, that's fair. Um, but... Losing that game just because I was just lazy at the end and couldn't be asked waiting 60 seconds for decisive. Um, would he have made that doorway in 60 seconds? Was the decisive guaranteed? He probably would. So I think I had to pick him up actually. And therefore it was just about the fact that I did miss that, um, that final blink. And this is what I mean about playing Nurse. You, you basically just end up on like one blink. You've got one chance. You've got to make this hit right now. It's a 50-50 often on which way they're going to go. Sometimes it's even lower than 50-50 and you've just got to make sure you've got a read on them. Um, it's very, very hard to play Nurse, especially at the high levels. At low levels, Nurse just feels dirty because the, the the survivors just don't know what to do and you just murder them. Uh, double pick Spirit. I mean, Spirit is still super, super strong. In fact, Spirit just got a lot, lot stronger because they just buffed her by giving her the, um, the movement speed boost that she was supposed to have the whole fucking time coming out of her ability. So when she comes out of her ability, she now gets the lunge that she was always supposed to have. Um, and it's a huge buff. <coughs> Um, it's as you come out of the... So it's like you go, pa and you go, lunge, and it's just fast. It's literally just that long. It's like one, one and a half seconds or something. There are add-ons to make it last longer. I don't know the exact timings, but I know it's not long at all. But it's it's a suit. It's like it's not like a demogorgon lunge, but Spirit and Wraith were supposed to have these really fast long lunges that came out of their stealth and phase abilities respectively, and they were both not working for the longest time. It's so funny how long it takes them to fix uh, killer bugs compared to survivor bugs. So like something's wrong with the survivor perk. It's like right, we're taking the servers down. It's done in three hours. Killer bug, like, oh, three months later, yeah, we've had a look at it, we're thinking about it. Like, this nurse um, blink bug that we saw about two games ago, where my nurse is just going, <laughs> and refusing to do a second blink, that's been around for two years. Two years. Oh. <sighs> I can imagine that some coder somewhere is just having nightmares. Because he's just been working on it the whole time. Yeah, right. I wish they'd just show us some stats. Uh, I believe there are stats um, available. So, for example, killer speeds, terror radiuses, and so on are given in meters per second and uh, meters and so on. Um, so, there are more stats available than the base game itself shows you. You have to go looking for them a little bit. Googling is your friend. But, um, oh, you mean win-loss stats, right? Yeah, that would be interesting. Number of three kills, four kills, two kills, time of match. Like, the amount of stats that they could give you when your ruin went down. Um, oh. Well, it's it's uh, it's difficult to say that based solely on stats because the only people left playing killer are the hardcore masochists um, who are probably pretty good at the game. And all your little chill survivors are left to do their own thing. Anyway, right, let's focus in. doing very fucking little right now. This is weird. Okay, there we go.
I mean, they're right next to Shaq, so... Oh, hello. No, Claudette, no. Dwelf wanted to be chased, Claudette didn't, so guess what? And Shag Pallet? My god. Close. Ah. So that's one toasted. One's going b straight back to that gem we just saw the Claudette run across, so we're gonna basement hook him. Take the free hit, why not? Oh, what? What? That guy's been hooked. Right, that's been long enough now, so... Should be enough time for someone to have tried to save him. We're also pushing them off this gen, letting Ruin do its thing. Making sure we let Ruin do its thing. Again, still nobody fancies it. He goes into second hook stage. Here's the Dwarf. Oh, two of them are here, that's great. It means that one of them is doing nada. Again, Dwarf wants to be chased. So let's oblige this time. As long as they're not on that gen, I'm fine with it. They're going to try and get back on it because they know that it's ticking back down. There we go. There's David. Borrowed time has run out. Dead hard hasn't though, so he gets the dead hard. They get the unhook. And I get the kill. Now, he probably has Decisive, but I'm going to go with Operation Disrespect It. Which, once again, pays off. Two on our generator. This one's not doing shit. Oh, did they just get that one on? No, that was a different one. Oh, sucks to be Dwight, doesn't it? Jesus. Right, let's see if he's also disrespecting the decisive. Nope. Alright. Good lad. No greed. All of them injured now. Back to lurking, killing people. Enjoy. Thought I'd get that in time, honestly. I thought I would get the grab, but we did not. So. Get the clawed. One of them was busy healing himself, so that's good. He's not a threat. We get the hit and the push off.
wow. That they got that gen done there was pretty big. Quite unexpected, honestly. Nice. So we saw him, we predicted his movement, and we get to do a little slugging along with our hook. Which is great, slows them down, they've got to come running. Or they've just got to sacrifice two people. Either one is good for me. Keeping our eyes open there, limiting the time they've got to take advantage. Hunt down Zadwelf. We've already used his decisive, so we know that's not up. Scratch marks. We'll cut off the uh, escape, so we're on the claw again. Wait for the blinks. One, two, there it is. She passes through just. And she cuts back round. She cut all the way round. Nope. So we're getting her down. They've been spending their time healing up, so... Good news. Go and pop her on a far hook, so they've got to go a long way to sort her out. Meanwhile, Ruin will be making a mess of their day. Alright. No progress on this, Jen. First gen of the game, no progress. Gen near her was no progress, so the only one that we need to check on right now is indeed the one that they've just doubled up on. We push them off, and Ruin gets to do its thing. Gone the wrong way. One, two blinks there. Yeah. Don't think she's got decisive. This is this girl's last hook. Yeah. Fine. So they should now go for the unhook. And they do oblige. We get to go back on the dwelf. That was cool. That was very, very cool. I liked that a lot. That was a cr pretty cool uh, firecracker. That was, yeah. Right on the nose, Blink. you got to give him quite serious testicle awards for that. So, just the two left. Ruin stayed up the whole game, so obviously Noed not the champion. Oh, they were here. Run around this way. And behind this rock. Uh, so she is 
dead, maybe? Don't know. Let's just basement hooker. It's close anyway. I, I'm hoping she's not dead. Ah, she's dead. So, other guy very likely gets the hatch. There's very little we can do about it in this type of game, but we will... Check to see if it spawns here. It did not. And he gets the hatch. Free escape for the survivor. And a rank up for me. So where did I not get it? Didn't get it for the hooks. Didn't quite get it for the uh, applying. Obviously I would get the iridescent if I got that last hook instead of the... Um, Hatch. And that one would have been 70, 18, 19. No, it still wouldn't be enough. to downgrade slightly, but we'll take a Mori to uh, compensate. And I think this will be the last game as Killer, and I'll probably switch over a little bit over to uh, Survivor. Fairly soon. Just need to get the chat up so the survivors can just have a little mini orientating themselves. There we go. Right, so where's my ruin? That's actually not a bad ruin spot. They've immediately popped discordance, so let's go and reward them with the personal touch. Mag. Rewind the blinks and then go back for the feng. Yep, she was here. There we go. Iron will. I'm all ears. What? She just slow vaulted? Come on, fast vault, fast vault. Oh, 
Well, if you're not going to fast spot, I'll just down you. Alright, so. We've spotted the Meg to our right. We've regressed this one basically to zero, no problem. So we know Meg's right in front of us. Most likely she's right here. Yep. Off she goes. Sprint first in the way. Oh, I should have just committed the second uh, blink to that. Never mind. If someone else wants to unhook, I can focus on this Meg. It is fine. That's going to cost me. Alright, so... One, two... Where are you going there? Mm, I'm all ears at least. Max distance. Yes. Such bad play. Oh. I'm rewarding this kind of sloppiness. It is bad. Fortunately, she finally cocked up under pressure. Which is good. Let's pop her over here. Mainly just because I think it's the only hook that we could have made in the time available. Pretty sure they're doing a discordance generator. They are, and it's as far from me as it could possibly be. One. Two. Do push him off. Ruin is down though. So he went off this way. There he is. We knew they were going to get it, but as long as I trade a hook for it, it's not that bad without ruin we can't expect to get much value where's he gone come on that was right on ay 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 Fifties that are incorrect here. Made one of them right, which was nice, but yeah, that's okay. So we'll pick him up here. Again, they're forty-fouring a gen, and again, it's too far for me to possibly reach it. Spotted the Feng halfway up. Yeah. Our chances of winning this game rest solely in the hands of Noed. That was on. These did so many hits that are just dipping just off the end of the tip of the blade, and it's like. Oh, you're giving me blink bug now as well? Like, I need that in this game. Like, I don't have enough problems. Alright, well, at 
we predicted that. Yeah, of course, immediate 44 the moment we start hitting someone. Will they get it? Or can I blink to it? This is where pop. Alright, we resume the chase, and this is where, if they've got decisive, we just lose the game. Both doors, one side. The only girl I could find was the one that had decisive. Pick her up. Hope. Hoping was successful. Sprint burst was also successful. game. Hope they're not here fast enough to take advantage and get the unhook. Okay, she's nailed it, so. Alright, we get to hook swap. her down. What? Oh, it was a sprint burst, not a dead hard. Right, okay. No, no. We need to go and get this pick up now. Committed so hard for this. That girl went for the gate open. We get this girl, we hook her up here. Oh, that girl's legged it. Right, we get three. From zero to three with no head. Might even be enough to get us a, a, a rank up, possibly at least a D rank protection, I would say. Where's she gone? Fair attempt, fair attempt. Decide you? No. Alright.
No it. No it and Mori. That was tight. That was very, very tight. Brutal. We didn't even rank up for that. We got three. And no rank. Eight, eight. Jesus. Only just as well. So that was just off gold. A little bit off gold. Quite a bit off gold. And quite a bit off iridescent. Decisive, decisive, decisive. So this was a game where decisive was actually king. Someone playing against the doctor meta. Mm -hmm. Plus, I suppose, stuff like infectious, Billy infectious in general. Mm. All right, nice. So we're going to play one as survivor now. See how that goes. Jump in on my Yui. And let's see what items we'll take with us today. Do we fancy a key? Or just a good old toolbox? I think a toolbox will do. Let's take some rags on it or whatever. And some blood points. So, we are currently going with Unbreakable over Decisive. Don't know if it's correct, but that's where I'm at. You could change We'll Make It for Decisive. It's a question. We need to keep it in mind based on the new meta, based on the new way the game is played. We'll play a few games and start feeling it out, whether this perk and this perk... Or also, we could play Dead Hard, but I mean, again, it's, it's mainly down to my playstyle more than anything else that makes us play uh, Sprint Burst there. Another Yui with our toolbox. Sorry about that, just had uh, some messaging stuff come up on the side there, it is dealt with, and we are back in. So things that we've seen from um, our games as killer is that 
especially if they've got Discordance, but even if they don't, I think that 44-ing gens has become less effective than multiple 80 gens. Although we've all started here, so the chances that we're not going to just spam this generator down are zero. And there's the Oni to punish. So, immediate search for Ruin begins. We're not going to jump on that gen because it's the next one that he will naturally check. Keeping our eyes open and then we'll just get this gen done. Toolbox plus greats is a very fast gen. So he almost certainly had barbecue and chill, but I'm going to disrespect it and just try and finish this gem before he can reach me. Pretty sure I'll be successful. I'm going to burn sprint burst to make distance away from that gen. He immediately catches. I'm going to hope that my teammates have got that sorted. They do, they're all focused on being altruistic, so I'm going to focus on getting gens done. I am making a bit of a mistake doing this generator because we are effectively shortening his patrol path that he needs to make, but, um... Oh, have they already fucked it? Looks like they've already fucked it. I probably need to get involved, but I really don't want to. Yeah, triple slug. I'm going to wait for him to actually hook people. for the first one. He can actually hit through the other one. I was planning to use her to body block myself, but it didn't work. So. Yeah, they all got themselves triple slugged. We did two gens. We tried to get involved. We almost snuck past him. Didn't work. All get caught. Slugged. And killed. Sadly, I wasn't one of the ones that got slugged because I had Unbreakable sort of ready for this sort of situation. Um, anyway, we can go for the Kobe. Don't get it. No point in struggling, just let it go. And if that guy gets the hatch, then God bless him. So that was a very quick game. Nice work, Connie. 
Onis are so built to slug. Yeah, so I did well with uh, Lightbringer. Did two generators really fast, but the rest of it was a horror show. I don't think I'm in the mood to play Survivor, so what I'm actually going to do is I'm going to change over to playing a bit of Smite. Not something I've streamed before, um, and not something that I'm currently uh, um, particularly good at, but we'll jump in and give it a go. So I'll change the... title
I don't know what the fuck's going on. Like I, every game it seems to change which lane is solo and which one's duo and it confuses the piss out of me. But Athena definitely seemed like she came out of that worse than we did. Now, I mean, the fact that she's on her own means that maybe this guy's doing this. No. I might be able to kill her if she fucks this up. Yeah, I will be able to kill her if she fucks this up. We delayed her going back quite a bit there, which is nice. So we can push this up. And if she doesn't have a, uh, a teleport glyph, then we'll be able to in a good chunk of damage on the tower, which is nice. And again, I'll do my job. And get that all away. And she's back, so we got half the tower. That's nice. into the middle where she should get hurt for it, but... Your left tower is under attack. That will make them scream. Oh, wrong lane. Last lane, last game, the left lane was ADC lane, and this lane, I mean, it, I, I don't know. Did Athena die for that, or did she get away with it? She got away with it. That's bad. Well, I can go and help out with this, maybe. run away was a success. Operation run in again. Alright, and we're out of mana. should be able to just make her life miserable. I 
clip her with chains here, she is in trouble, but if she cuts me into sour range, it's bad. I mean, I don't know what he's doing. Why is he tower diving? We don't need to. I did have blink ready, maybe I could have done something there actually. for a kill seems decent he's now got the lane let's let him have the xp and get out of here oh should i be pushing that for the tower i don't know maybe that was a mistake don't know An don't know anyway no let's do that and i've got that let's get a couple of health potions and then let's start moving Your straight towards bridwin which is sort of like a, a buff for my ultimate oh going to the wrong lane again let's go mid your team has destroyed a right enemy tower. Our man's doing good on the right there, so if we've put Athena back enough, then maybe I can just jump on in here. No. Good. Oh, hello. We are leveling up nicely here, but at what cost? Time to leave. Yeah, let's not get involved in getting myself murdered. Over there, meanwhile, let's bring up an Ares guide very quickly. Gods, Ares, top guide, items, right. Uh, we're going towards Pridlins. Yeah, let's get a couple of health potions. Off we go. Your team has destroyed a left enemy tower. 800 to Pridwin. Alright, Thanatos is on someone. We're going to move up the middle. I think he's got it, but just in case someone else gets involved. Oh, hello. Fine by me. He's got someone else. He's got Neath. Do I need to be involved again? Yes, I do. So 
Toasty, toasty, toasty. Whoop. Yeah, that was real, real bad. That was very nicely played by Kixualni. I don't know what that does, but there we are. So, we get my parade win, and we're looking now for... Your team has sovereignty, destroyed a middle uh, Although it was actually magical damage that was screwing me. Uh, if it's magical damage, maybe void stone? Magical power, magical protection, this seems better. Let's do that, and then let's get some... ...wards. And away we go. Got three on one on the left, so we should win that, no problems. If those guys open their eyes... Are they opening their eyes? We seriously have to get involved here. No! I mean, fine. I put them really low. If anyone was nearby, we would have had uh, good work there, but sadly, you know, it's not always the case. So, we're going towards Voidstone, so we'll take that. Stone of Binding is really good, but um, I want to go with aura items a little bit more, keep my magic power up. Uh, and then, I think, let's have a look. I think Pythagoras' piece might actually be a uh, a useful item here. Not sure. I've fallen behind a little bit in levels. Right Not much, just a little. So Neath is there. Killing spree. <laughs> Double kill. Shut down. So we put a lot into her there. And I think she's actually underestimated it quite badly. Yeah, she has. And, you know, good work from the Ganesh. Ooh. Just didn't quite get the third chain. I was greedy, shouldn't have gone to the third chain. So I went for the third chain because then I could use my uh, E, my uh, buff, uh, protection buff, and it would have been a bit more effective because it's boosted per chain, and I was hoping to save him. Greed. Greed, greed, greed. Right. Um, so, what happened there? We got CC'd quite hard. Uh, what protects against CC? Mantle of Discord seems pretty good. Let's go Mantle of Discord. I haven't been using my wards, that's not good. My mistake. Need to get involved, because I can blink ulti this. If I get there, I'll be able to do a lot. I have a really big ulti on this hero. I 
thought we had more available there. That is really unfortunate. That instead of us getting a lot of good stuff, they got us murdered. Oh no. Bad engage. I thought it was good. I thought I got three of them. Stunned them all. Toasted them a bit. Like they were focused on me. Doesn't matter if I die, as long as they die. It seemed it seemed like a reasonable play. That's um that's upsetting. Right, so we're gonna go for this mantle of discord, I think. Or maybe one of these items, like... 15% damage mitigation for 3 seconds every time you hit. Once every 15 seconds. Or it'll just protect me from one. Jesus. Missed. That was horrific. That was really, really bad. That was the first truly shocking bit of play we've done this game. I do apologise to my team for that one. That sucked. Right. So do we want protection from a root? Your middle tower has been destroyed. I think the spirit robe. I don't know, but I'm just going to have a guess and say spirit robe. Don't currently have my ult, so I don't want to. Seems good. Attack middle lane. what I could there. Could go for a blink ult, but we're all low. Oh, but they are really thinking about it, aren't they? She's popped an ult for it. Just trying to help my mate there, not going for any sort of kills. Gonna move back and heal up and spend. Operation Don't Die. Protect me from those worthy of combat. Our second one. Hey, we're going to go with this magic shell, I think. Two of us have got it, so it's not great, but I don't know. Don't really know the game well enough. Could have maybe gone for Heavenly Wings or something. But they seem to have a lot of magic damage AoE, so I think having the ability to give us all a little magic shell seems good. Plus I've got my ult, so let's try. So we lost one on one side, but we're holding middle reasonably well. Oh. 
Nice. Strategically, now would be time to regroup. I just ran into them so that our other guys could get away. I wasn't going to get out of that, I didn't think, but seemed like they might. So, are we still taking the spirit robe? I think so. And then... Do with more auras, I suppose. Mystical mail. I bugger it. We'll go with that. I don't know any better, so I still haven't placed a single ward. Jesus. Let's see if we can get involved with my ultimate. Well. That one well. An enemy has been slain. Attack middle, attack middle, attack middle, attack middle, attack middle, attack middle. Keep your friends close and your enemies closer. Attack middle, attack <laughs> So, did what I needed to, tanked the tower. Should I get involved in that? No, I'm too low life. Now I'm ready for battle. An ally has been slain. That was a very good blinkle. Caught exactly what we wanted to, and we now need to go and get this hatch here. Some help. Three versus three in mid. We've got one on the left just doing a bit of pushing. Let's quickly clear these creeps, get the XP. Sweaty amount of damage. Beautiful. I can't just take a phoenix to the face, so we're gonna have to wait a second. Yeah. Kind of hoping they'd do more damage. Doesn't matter, it's not an aura. Emperor's armor for tower pushing. Or just mystical mail for damage. Let's just take Mr. Kimmel, that's what I wanted to go for, so let's go for it in first place. And we did put down our wards finally, so that's nice. And let's upgrade my Blink Rune, since it's going to be a big part of Ares' play. Uh, me being in the top 
right on this game isn't smart, is it? Let's put me bottom right. An ally has been slain. is under attack. An ally has been slain. They're actually losing that fight on the left? Oh my god. The idea was very much that they would not lose that fight on the left. What are you doing? Tasty, tasty ult, it would seem. Looks like they're in the middle with Nemesis 20, so let's move over. Catch him if he runs away. He is running away. Do we make this? Does he make this? Looks like he doesn't. Oh god, Neath again. Are you going to get there in time? Did he get it? He didn't get it. Oh fuck. Hit the wrong key, wasted my ult, not good. Right, let's sell that. Go to that, because it's the same build up to get this sort of thing. And we'll get the Emperor's armor. So, next time we get a one fight, we'll be able to push better with my um, Emperor's armor, because their towers won't be as good, and if we have to defend, it'll be better. As soon as we get in here, Emperor's armor, so he does actually attack a lot less. They're all dead, so we just go straight towards the side. And that's it. GG. I think Ganesha was <laughs> quite fun in that game, so yeah, bugger it. Um, and he seemed pretty good. We got a triple. 
we killed a dark, uh, tower going for the Tower of the Phoenix, and we killed three enemies in a row, killing spree. Right, okay, yeah. Let's have a look. So, 13 for 8 with 14 assists. It's a good score. Really good. That's, uh, for me, uh, a big improvement. Player damage. Um, not the lowest, but certainly in the bottom three. So, we've got 20k my 19k and his 16k and then we've got our two damage dealers with 32 and 25 so fair enough um the enemy team it was that water girl that was just dishing out the damage wasn't she Whew. damage taken um we didn't take much more than our compatriots honestly but we did mitigate a crap load more obviously we're playing the tank so that's not at all surprising but still um Nice to see. We ended up with a lot of gold. A lot of good items. Yeah, happy with that. That was a good... Uh, a good one. So there's a chest there. Let's have a look so we can claim something. Oh yeah, let's equip the snowman ward skin. That's cool. What's this? A hero chest. The South Korean avatar. Fuck it, let's equip that. So now with South Korean. Nice. Uh, level up bonus, 50% off any chest, don't give a damn, and a free guard. Nice. Uh, so, coupon, uh, don't give a damn. Oh, I guess I got to just pick a voice pack and unlock it for free. Right, right. So, free guard, we can get Hebo, Hercules, or Anhur. Um, I've seen Anher played a few times. I don't know the other two. I'm no interest in Hercules just because he's Hercules. So let's go with Anher. I don't know anything about it, but what the hell? So free voice pack, eh? Let's have a look and see what voice packs are available. Uh, so if we go to the store, where do we find? Voice pack. Here we go. And I can coupon one of these. Nice. Well, Aries it has to be, obviously. So we get it. Sweet. Cool. How do we... Uh... How do we equip that? I have no idea. Uh, anyway, while we're here, let's do the God Builder thing and set up Ares' start because... Um, So that's nice. And then core seems to be uh, popular boots, shoes of focus, yeah. And aura items in general. Sovereignty seems to be a big favourite. Void stones are good. And I like the spirit rule, but let's have a look for... What was it? P something something. Can't remember now. Um... That's the one, Pridwin. Uh, so we'll put those in core, then in damage. Again, we'll go to aura, and I think... Mystical Mail was some damage for sure. Let 
Magical binding's kind of aggressive. A stone of binding, sorry, is pretty aggressive. Obviously, I mean, let's not pretend that I know what I'm doing. I have no idea what I'm doing, but... Um, this one seems decent for an aggressive build. And what else seems good for an aggressive build? Attack speed increased. This is magical protection, crowd control reduction. That's a healing reduction. Attack speed reduced by 20%. And faster. I like that. We'll stick the Witchblade in. And then defensive stuff would be stuff like... Magic protection and health, I suppose. We're probably ignoring some non-aura items um, that we might maybe should be looking at, but... Uh, let's put Gaia in this list. Maybe take Gaia out of this list again. I'm just going to take it out for a sec and then put it back in again. So if you're hit by a knock up. You gain health. And then it regenerates health. Yeah, alright, let's put that in. I don't know, maybe it'll be useful one day. And then last one, let's just put in something like... Is Sovereignty's already in, right? Uh, I suppose Heart Ward might be decent. And then that's a bunch of items that could be good for him. Let's take that out and put in... Mana Potions. And then down here we get the Relics, which is obviously the Blink Rune. Second one could be Heavenly, could be... Tempson. So that's just a damage buff for everybody. Yeah, Belt of Frenzy could be sweet then. And last one as an option. I mean, that, that game we went for Magic Shield Shell, right? So let's put those in as some possibilities. And then in terms of our consumables, I suppose Wards is the first and most important. Then Magic Power. And then the big boys in case we ever need those. Save. Abilities is... Flesh, Shackle Shackles, Bolster, that, Shackle Shackles, Slash Shackles, Flesh, 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 Bolster, 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 I skip, 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 save. Nice! Uh, voice pack is owned. Stay here! I'll attack! Bye! Enemies in middle lane! Enemies in your battle! Base. Jesus, there's a lot of Aries. Red. Right, sweet. Well, that is sadly all we have time for today. I do not have time to play another one. I've got to go and get some dinner ready. So, um... Thank you for joining. Hope you've had a good afternoon. And I'll be back this evening with the usually scheduled stream. And look forward to seeing you then. Take care.